Welcome to the weekend edition of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. I'm your host, Dave Palumbo, and I'm here to bring you all the latest news in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. It's Friday, July 10th, 2015, and let's get to it. A very wise man once said, don't try to reinvent the wheel. But he didn't say anything about the bench press, which might explain why Brandon Curry is adopting some unconventional training methods for this year's Olympia prep. Curry was spotted doing what he describes as an earthquake press as he gears up to make yet another run at breaking into the top eight on the Olympia stage. But if Curry's doing earth tremor training, I have to assume that Cedric McMillan is doing quantum mechanics training and Kai Green is doing, well, we don't know what the heck he's doing, but back to Curry, he's clearly doing something right. But that doesn't mean we don't get to question the methods to his madness. There very well may be someone in the bodybuilding realm more entertaining than our old friend Big Sean Allen, but you'd be hard pressed to find him. Despite the fact that we haven't seen much of him on a stage recently, Allen is still looking bigger and badder than ever. Recently, the man known worldwide by three simple letters, BSA, released some video in the gym doing what he does best, moving weight and talking trash. Allen hasn't announced whether or not he plans to make a return to the stage anytime soon, but we can be sure that when he does, he'll be sure to put the bodybuilding world on notice. That BSA is back. There's a short list of athletes who have what it takes to give Phil Heath a run for his money, and Sean Roden is certainly one of them. Over the weekend, footage leaked of a recent arm training session where we see Flexitron heaving up some massive dumbbells as he prepares yet again to face off against the sport's undisputed champion. Roden has yet to compete this year and is putting all his eggs into the very delicate Olympia basket. But if he shocks the world and does the impossible, he'll pull off one of the greatest upsets the sport has ever seen. The USA Championships are still three weeks away, but it looks like light heavyweight powerhouse Adam Young is ready to get the party started. Young is a prodigy of Dylan Armbrus, and after narrowly missing out on a top 10 at last year's NPC Nationals, he appears to have spent his offseason doing quite a bit of growing. Young is already bigger and harder than he was a year ago, and if he continues to sharpen up as we approach contest time, it wouldn't be much of a surprise to see him land in the first callout and battle it out for a shot at the title. Adam Young isn't the only light heavyweight looking to make a splash at the USA. Last year's second place finisher, Thomas Lenahan, looks like he spent the entire offseason hungry as a wolf, and now he's out for blood. The perpetually shredded Lenahan is looking sharp, even by his own standards, and it looks like he and coach Don Long have cooked up a recipe for success. Now that last year's light heavyweight champion Cal Blanchard has graduated onto the ranks of the IFBB, there may not be anyone left who can stand between Lenahan and the victory. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. Check out IronMagLabs.com today. I'm your host, Dave Palumbo, reminding you to always be true to your passions. And make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.